here I have a three bone rib roll. Pepper it. I have it all salt and peppered, and you can put it in your oven just like this. But I like to put a little mustard on there. This is John mustard or Dijon. And just just some, and put it over the top. If it goes down the sides, it's okay. Just kind of get it off. I don't like it on the sides. Just on the top. I'm using about a fourth of a cup if I didn't tell you that. And into, I'm baking it on this pan, on this rack, because I don't have a fancy pan. And this is going to go in my 350 degree oven. I'm going to bake it until I'm going to measure the temperature in the center like that until it reaches 135 degrees. Here it is, just out of the oven. I'm going to cover it and let it sit here for 15 20 minutes. That way, all the juices that are going wild like a microwave inside will keep on basting itself. It's rested for 20 minutes, and you can do two things now. You can turn it, and you can cut these ribs off, which they just pretty much come off anyway. There's a whole lot of good eating on those. Or you can just leave them on there. And slice it into big slabs with the bone on there, but they pretty much came off anyway. Slice it. And there's your prime rib or rib roast. Cook the prime rib way. Here's a big old slab of it, the meat. That's some good eats. Thanks so much for watching.